Okay, BBC Pigeon audience, una good morning. This morning, we day for the Federal High Court Abuja, where the trial of um, the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, the proscribed group, that's the group where government don't ban, will take place today. This is now day two of the trial of the leader of the proscribed group, uh, IPOP, Nandi Kanu, they happen for the Federal High Court today. And we did can't pay for here to give an authority as they happen as soon as they see um, security don't take over, don't block the main entrance to the Federal High Court, oh. all the main strategic entrance to the Federal High Court, they don't block them. Um, security don't beef up around the Federal Secretariat as it does in the road that they lead to the Federal High Court as is. And as you they see, then they screen anybody where they go there, anybody where won't gain entrance into the Federal High Court from the Federal Minister of Justice down to the Federal High Court. Then they screen them. Those who don't get access to be to go there, they know they allow them in. So today, waiting will happen for court today. We know say yesterday night the trial starts. Yesterday for inside court, we know say um, Nadi Kano appear inside court yesterday. One of the major things where we go see for court today now say now be say Nadi Kano go take plea, then go read out all the additional 15 charges where government don't summer, don't amend the 15 amended charges and go read them to Ram today and um Nadi Kano go plead whether guilty or not guilty to the charges we know say before na seven count charge where then summer on top in head but now government don't add to those charges and some of the things where government add to the charges now say um one say through say him through in um, broadcast being commit um be instigate people for Lagos State, make them burn the buses for Lagos State. That's it. They say it affect the transport system for Lagos State, where, where, whereby it affects the economic um, growth of Nigeria. Another thing where they say they say it instigate or incite people to come out to cause katakata for Lagos State. There are those there are additional charges where they aside the ones where they don't summer on top in head before. So these are some of the new charges where we they see then saying is to get people to kill 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 police people for the country. So those ones are additional charges where we go see where they go read give them as I think will appear for court today. Another major thing where we go see where go happen for court today in the sake of say now they can't go wear new clothes for inside courts today. Sake of say, since when they repatriate, now they can enter Niger, he never change in clothes. We see say now only one clothes they wear. For those of Nawedon, they see in pictures from court, you know, say now only one clothes they wear. So in lawyers can't carry him out, cry, enter court, say since when he, he, he then repatriate him, illegally come Niger to come answer, to come face the law, say he never change in clothes. Then say also say then they um, draw blood from his body for test. They know they show and they test results. The lawyer also accused say, you know, they chop well. Then say, you know, they sleep for better bed. And they say, okay, the place is put them for solitary confinement. So um, the presiding judge, Justice Bita Nyaku, can't tell uh, DSS, can't give them orders, say, make them make sure, say, um, nah, they can wear new clothes, enter court today. So another thing where they see where they phenomena for inside courts today, na sake of say, um, nah, they can go wear different clothes today. So if you know wear different clothes, it means say, DSS no obey court order. But go, um, tri the trial judge, Justice Binta and Nyaku don't give them orders, say, make them make sure, say, he wear um, different clothes. So, but some, uh, maybe summarize waiting happened for court yesterday. We know, say, the trial supposed to start yesterday, it's supposed to take in plea yesterday. But in lawyers say, they no go allow and take the plea because they never, they acquainted with the new amended charges. That means, it means, say, they never tell them, they never discuss with them, waiting those amended amend, amended charges be, and how they never interpret and around. And so, sake of say, they never talk about them with them, say they know if take plea. They also say they serve the charges on the eve of the trial, which means now on the 17th, the trial is supposed to be on the 18th, but then serve the trial, then serve the, the charges on the 17th. And they say because of the way where the thing happen sharp 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 like that they no get time to really study the the, the new charges so that they go prepare them for 
the legal battle ahead. So sake of that one, now he make where they no they no continue with the trial yesterday. But today, um, I'm waiting the judge to talk. We say make them give them time for inside court. So after the court called adjunct today, then give them time so that they go feel sit down with Umnandi Kanu so that they go discuss the charges with them. Tell and waiting he be and how he go answer the charges so they don't do that one part of them for inside court yesterday and today waiting we go see say the Obonge trial go start today and we may focus be say then go read the charges to Ram whether and he go plea whether he did guilty or not guilty to the 15 count charges so now waiting will happen for court this morning but waiting will they see outside the court now be say people don't they arrive inside the court by 9 a.m local time court doors go they open um lawyers and everybody were supposed to enter court go they court we see yesterday they they try to start they court the judge entered uh, court around 9 56 a.m so this time too around 10 a.m local time we go they shall say uh, courts go day uh, people go sit down the judge said go day on seat for the process to continue so now waiting they happen for the nigerian capital abuja for the federal high court where we go they monitor the trial of um Mnandi kanu where be the leader of the proscribed group um ipop where it go happen for the federal high court today and it happened for court too where um the judge now the presiding judge for this case now justice binta unyaku now she they handle the matter and we're going to bring now all the details as it they happen but waiting we now know be say security day okay security day strategic location everything they go on well they know they harass people like then the kind of drama where they happen before you know day ground everything they do they day all right they make sure say then get all the names of cases where they happen for court and the lawyers were supposed they court if your name no day you know supposed they and so because of that everything they go orderly then they do all their searches well they know no harassment and anybody where no gets needs to day inside court no they day court today so now waiting they happen for the federal high court where we day outside they bring on Tori on top how the trial of um, the IPOP leader Nadi Kanu will go on today okay if you just the watch us this now the bbc pigeon live broadcast from the federal high court abuja where the trial of the leader of the proscribed group indigenous people of biafra do happen today we know say um in the ingo respond to the new additional 15 count charge where government don't summer on top in head and the charges they bring and come courts on the 17th of january 2021 then they amend those charges and we go to watch waiting they happen where they bring on a development as they happen for court so now for here we go march break until we enter courts where we go bring on our details of waiting they happen